All right, people, welcome back. I thought I'd show you my new creation. We have another space frame, but it's a two-seater space frame. And it's got a tunnel going down the middle of it, because that's what the customer wanted. So there's some subtle differences from this frame to the last frame. So I'll show you what they are. Right then, here we go. <clears throat> so that is a two-seater frame. Now, we'll show you the differences from this one to this one. Now, this one has got one-piece doors, door bars, top and bottom, gusted it out. There's a slight different angle to these to allow for a bit more space up here for the seats. Well, not so much the seats, more the headroom, because the seat does come... About here, because it's a bit tight. So we've got those door bars slightly different. This bar here comes slightly further back up the top. The other one came to about here. I've done that to give a bit more support to the top because we're not having these bars here. We have an A, as you call it, in the back, because it has one roof bar to allow for the two heads. Because if you have it over there, it's literally right above the driver's head. So I did one roof bar straight down the center for an A at the back. And the tunnel is that, literally. So that will come, the exhaust will go straight down there. And the back box, is going here I believe behind the passenger seat exiting out the side so I haven't put any brace in here because when he gets his box he'll have to figure out whether he can put an X in whether he needs to go straight and the same with I'm guessing a fire extinguisher will go behind that seat and all of this one is 3 mil wall so it's a little bit heavier but this is actually two-seater space frame that's also being rolled legal. So that's why I've gone a bit more three mil throughout. That's what the chat wanted. So it's all three mil wall, all throughout. It's not having this front subframe on it. It's actually having a Honda, I think, a Honda front subframe on it. So what I've had to do is these are a slightly different angle. These are slightly higher. Um, these, these are set, but they are just tacked in because I don't know what the rear of the subframe's like on the Hondas. So what it, he might have to do, he might have to break all this down and re-modify it. So I've just tacked those for now. Um, what else is different? We've got more gussets on all corners. What else have we done differently? I think that is about it. We've stitch welded these, which just I think look a little bit better than the full weld that I did on this one. As you can see, the door bars are 50 50 on this one. The floor is completely different. This one's just got a single diagonal, where this one's got the A. Uh, so, yeah, that's space frame number two. Probably got another day or so. Another day or, day or two working on it. It's got my rear end in it. For the uh, camber and caster adjustment. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's come out quite nice, this one has. I mean, the fit and finish, because this um, welder I'm using, it's top notch. I'm well happy with it. There we go. So I'd give you a quick, a quick tour of the two seater. So they can you can actually fit two seats in it. It's tight, but you can actually fit two seats in. Well, then, well, thanks for watching. See you later.